So my good friend Christina White over at WW Quality Frenchies actually invited us out to a show. Um, and we decided to go check it out. And we th- we went to the first show. We didn't even show our dog at all. We just walked around and networked and talked with people. And the vibe was just a good vibe. And we loved it. And we fell in love with it yeah, from like that our, day. Our Instagram following like jumped that day too. Yeah. Like it was a big jump. And it was like, like you said, people that's actually, you know, looking to do what we're doing or invest in the stud or something like that. So it was, it was definitely worth yeah. it. That's what made us open up our eyes. Like, dang, it's, you got to get out that local mindset and hit these shows. Like a lot of people ask all the time, like, how y'all getting these customers up? These shows, bro, these shows. We're not yeah. just trying to stay in Cleveland, finding people around here. You know, a lot of people in the city don't really support, you know, it's the shows getting out. When you build your name out there, then the city follows behind a lot of right. times. That's yeah. just how it goes. Yeah, that's Very a good true. game, man. Yeah. What What are some things you do to get your dogs prepared for a dog show? I would table. say getting them used to being on a table. So, you know, put your dog on a table, get them used to being on a table, get them used to being on a show lead. Um, Remember our first experience with uh, Ryan on a table? Yeah, they'll so cower they down. Did. They're scared. Oh, they don't want to be on a table. Yeah, so we got to make sure you practice. And with your dog I'll just go to a show and yeah, throw your dog out there see what your dog is doing get them comfortable being on tables yeah. walking you know i guess the sanction shows and the fun shows so with the sanction you want to get them used to walking which we know and, right and walking then, on a leash yeah. when we first started showing with sparkles uh with unicorn sparkles she didn't know how to walk on a leash so we, i'm over here dragging her around the <laughs> the ring and whatnot and then i was like oh shoot i gotta get her together Oh I start working too. with her every day and teaching her how to stand next to me, like how to trot, do all those things. And now she got yeah, it. Right. So it's like, you got to work with your dog every day and until, until they got it. Yeah, you know, some of the things you want to do, boss blood on, stack them on the table. I would say even go around crowds, get them right. used to being around crowds because these dogs should be flooded. Brown, you got to make sure the temperature right when they're, I mean, the, the temperament is right when they're around other dogs. You know, you see dogs on the table snapping at other dogs. Right. It's a lot of things. Yeah, I just saw You don't want to be that person. Yeah, you want to get to know your dogs for sure. Take them and get them used to those types of Take them to dog parks. Take them places with you to the store. Yeah, that's what we did. Realize, you know, so you can figure them out. They need to be socialized before you just mm-hmm. bring them to a dog show. And they're snapping at every dog. Every dog is not by. a show dog. You might not have a show dog, so you got to figure that out. And it's better to do it at home than get to a show and you dogs trying to fight and attack everything. I'm sitting here and barking at everyone. You, see, <laughs> you done drove four or five hours to the show. <laughs> yeah, that's that's funny. Um, my last guest I just had on the show previously last week. Um, he said that he would like to begin showing dogs in the show ring. Mm-hmm. What advice can you give to someone out there that's thinking about entering a dog show for the first time? I would basically like pretty much what we just said, work with your dog, work with your dog, put your dog on the table, stack your dog, take him for walks, do things like that. Just prepare your dog for that. And you just got to get out there and do it. Yeah, Man. even if you don't win nothing, it ain't all about yeah. winning either. We went to shows where we ain't win nothing. And after we left the ring, there's people approaching us. Hey, man, what's your Instagram? That's a very right. nice dog. And I'm like, you, you don't have to win to, to no. uh, network. No, <laughs> right. you possibly can get puppy sales from it, uh, things like stud, that. Stud, stud to, someone stud. might want to use your stud. Like, it's, it's your more reasons. Out there in that ring in the middle where everybody can see it. Maybe you missed a couple of people just walking around at the show, but everybody's watching that ring when those yep. shows going on. So even if you ain't confident that you're gonna win something, just still get out there and see what's going And just dogs. do it. Get your face, your brand, your dog seen. Yeah. When it comes to showing your dog, which one do you like better, the sanction show or the fun show? I like them both, to be honest. Um. I prefer sanction show just because you're able to showcase your dog. Like the people can actually see your dog, see them try. You can stack them like that. They're seeing everything about yeah, it. And just stack them onto the on side, the table. They just looking at your dog. Like 
They watching your dog work. They watching your dog how that everything. Dog walks, how it trots. You know, once it stops, how it stops. Is it going to like you know? It's a lot. It's like of training. It. So I it's feel like, like you showcase your dog a lot more with what your sanction shows. But don't get me wrong, I still like fun shows. Yeah. And I still do fun shows. And when most of the times when we go to a show, I'm doing sanction and fun show. Yeah, we do both. So yeah, I'm sure. putting I'm doing sanction show, then when the fun show starts, I'm running over there too. I'm, I want it all. <laughs> right. And all the right. unicorns, part of those pictures is a bunch of ribbons. <laughs> that's the sanction show, and there's always one or two trophies. And that's from the, the fun show. show. <laughs> you know, so, the sanction show is mostly the ribbon and stuff. Yeah. So I yeah, honestly like them both. <laughs> Would would you like to uh, one day show one of your dogs something that you produce in the AKC show ring, like maybe like you know the Westminster type? Oh, most shows? definitely, definitely. Yeah, 